Well, we made it. The sun is just about to drop down. It looks absolutely incredible. Beautiful white sand, sun dropping. Good mates, cold beers. Yeah, baby, yes. Welcome back to another episode of Explore Offshore. This time we're out at Rolly Shoals, 260 k's off the coast of Broome. To say this episode's gonna be a little bit out of control is an understatement. We're heading out on a catamaran. We got tenders, scurfing, diving, spear fishing. It's all going on. We're scurfing right now through the channel. This is as good as it gets. Stay tuned. Let's go. We're down here Ganth Point, we got the old sea legs, so we've just loaded all the gear over onto the cat. We're doing the last run and uh, we are out of here. We've got a little bit of a weather gap, so we're gonna have a little bit of good weather and then it's probably gonna go all bad, but it's gonna be fun anyway. Let's get stuck in. All right, well, here we go. What an absolutely epic adventure this is shaping up to be. We've gathered one hell of a crew and we're heading out to the infamous Rolly Shoals for the next seven nights. We're heading out with Broom Tours. We've got Jacko, our captain. We've got the number one decky in all of WA. We've got Critter tagging along for the adventure. Steph and Jade, the girls are coming out to show us how it's done. And then me good mates, Aiden, Matty, and of course, you should know Bobo, the go-go. Rolly Shoals, here we come. Let's go. Probably two hours, three hours into the trip, and Matty Boy's got himself a little tail. Oh, yeah, yeah, the boy. Snag another couple, we just had two uh, two lines sitting out the back. We're only chasing uh, sailies. So, yes, what a start to the trip. She's been a pretty good little morning uh, sneaking out. One sail, one tuna, one mackerel. So mackerel for dinner, we're pretty happy. It is a 22 hour steam to get out there. So uh, it's been a pretty chill day. It's coming in the afternoon now. We're coming over some uh, some good marlin ground. So uh, that's the aim for this afternoon. See if we can't add a fourth species of fish, which would be pretty epic. But uh, a couple of naps, a few people reading books. It's a pretty chilled day on the boat. The weather's been mint. Can't wait to get out there. Do it tight. Do it tight. Hold on to the door. Have it. 
gone in <laughs> all right well we've made it we're moored up the crew's just getting all of their uh gear together we're going for a sneaky little snorkel this morning just to get used to being in the water it was a bloody long night everyone's a little bit rough so a snorkel we'll take one gun out just in case we see any doggies steph's chasing doggies this weekend <laughs> no. so uh the tent will be back shortly and we'll head out happy days <laughs> First shot for the day, sail fin uh, snapper. That's all we got up, unfortunately. The sharks are a little bit vicious, but uh, good fun. Had a nice little snorkel through the uh, first little section, so I think we're gonna head back to the boat and uh, then we'll rig up properly tomorrow with spearing gear and hopefully we go better than that. Ha <laughs> 
<laughs> Jade, yep. you got a fishing comp. You're in the first boat. I'm in the second. The losing boat has to get beers for everyone else this afternoon on the beach. All night long. All night. All right. All night. You're on. You're Let's deal. go. Passion fruit trout and the rooster popper 105. Halco is not letting us down so far. Jeep is a, is a beautiful fish. Oh, and off he goes. Oh, two on. What's the bombies? <laughs> oh, what's your money? Oh, it's your money. Oh, 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 I reckon we're onto the winning fish here. I think that's that's definitely got to do it. So, sorry, Nat. Ah, uh, here it is. Yes. Uh, <laughs> yeah. Woohoo! Hello, they're back. We are back. How'd you go, team? We did extremely well. So, no fish? 30 uh, Thirty. fruit trout. Did you really? Yeah, yeah there was so many. They were everywhere. Couldn't get away from them. And our winning fish was a big, big humpy, humpy Mary Russ. So you didn't bring anything home? No, well. Just have to do it. It's going to have well, to trust the footage. I don't know. How does well, that, that's what they're telling the How does that work? Anyway. Is, it, is it supposed to be biggest fish you bring home to eat? Oh. <laughs> oh. I think they're, they're the I think you guys are going to put your money where you're <laughs> All right, we're off to show. Uh, Boat one, how useless they are. Have fun guys, we'll bring back dinner since you brought no fish back. All right, we got Steph. <laughs> oh God. Bobo. Woo. Go team. We got the captain. Let's get the eh? And uh, no, we're, we're dogging Jacko. Nah, he's coming. I think he's coming. Steph's on as well, it's all going on. Stunning. What'd you get, Woo. Steph? Long nose and proud. Bobo with oh, a big yeah. horse! Oh, Yay! On the slide dog. Yeah, oh, baby! On your Bobo, hold it like a shotgun. That's it. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you hold his cold kind of trout when you got it out. <laughs> Little humpy on the rooster. Halco baby. Halco baby. Two humpies in two casts. Fish, good fish, kid. Yeah, on the popper, big rooster. That one's bigger than the last one. Double oh, hookups as the sun goes down. Yeah, that is bigger than the last one. What a fish. Yeah, buddy. Off it goes. Well, good little afternoon, few long nose, couple of humpies. 
to the captain. Uh, we're going to race back just before the sun goes down and uh, get the rest of the crew. Are we going on the beach? Oh yeah, get Jack the crew on. and have a brew. We're going on the beach for a cold one. Happy days. <laughs> Two big dogs. How big? Bigger than yours. Oh, no. <laughs> there's a, there's, so a, there's a broad dilemma. I caught them both. Oh, <laughs> no. yeah. So you did lose. Oh, he was our fourth. Jacko was captain. <laughs> oh, All right, time to go and chase the sunset crew. Yeah. <laughs> Well, we made it. The sun is just about to drop down. It looks absolutely incredible. Beautiful white sand, sun dropping, good mates, cold beers. Yeah, baby, yes. So I tell you what, we did have a pretty rough ride out last night and uh, got a little bit wild, but once you're out here, well and truly worth it. It's only our second day. Uh, we've been down spearing. We've seen bucket loads of sharks, beautiful snorkeling. And then uh, we went out this afternoon for a hell good fish. The first crew cleaned up. Hats off to them, they definitely take the win. Uh, they were out for three hours. We went out for about an hour, got back so we could enjoy this sunset. But um, wow, what a spot. There's a couple of other big boats out here uh, that, that bring a crew out. So there's another little party going on on the beach. But um, if you ever get the opportunity or you're ever in Broome, go hit up the lads from Broome Tours. Get your ass out here. It's uh, it's pretty special, pretty special. I won't get too close, but there's um, a couple little timber huts that uh, wildlife put on the beach here for red tail something, something birds. We'll find, we'll find out, but they hatch and nest in here. What's the name of these ones? That's the old red tail tropic bird here, mate. Tropic bird. Yeah, they uh, they're only found on two islands in all the whole of Australia. One is this island, Bedwell Island, and one's um. The Sugarloaf Rock down near Yellinger, way down south. So yeah, they've built these huts to try and bring their numbers up, and it seems to be working pretty well. As you can see, there's a little chick in this one, which is pretty sick. Just walking back, the other thing we found up is uh, turtle track. Looks like probably come up pretty recent because the high tide didn't didn't uh, take it over. Turtle tracks come sneaking up here, lay his eggs up in there. So there must be a few of them getting around. Probably her eggs, mate. Probably her eggs, yeah. He probably didn't. He probably didn't lay them. We take credit for it, but we don't really. <laughs> we don't do a lot. We don't do a lot. <laughs> so nothing on this island whatsoever. Just just a big sand key that only goes under in cyclones. Very cool. All right, guys. So after a stellar little day on the beach and watching the stars go down. We got a family dinner going on here. Have a good Oof. have a look. Hey, <laughs> yeah, the family dinner. We got nine inside. So there's only uh, one thing left to do today, Maddie. What do we got? What yeah, do we, we got? got? The decade of the day. Decade of the day. We got any nominations? Any nominations, guys? I'd like to nominate uh, the man himself who's already <laughs> won it once. Bo for uh, leaving <laughs> the reigning champ. The reigning champ. <laughs> <laughs> For leaving a rod and reel in the water of the side while I was taking a photo of a fish that was still attached to the rod and reel without knowing. But it was a good photo, mind you. <laughs> <laughs> Any other nominations? No. 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 I think we do. I think we do. We're good. Jade. We're good. Jade, wrong fins. Jade did oh, forget yeah. the ro her fins and brought her partner's fins. Oh. All in favour of Jade, raise your hands. <laughs> All in favour of Bobo, raise your hands. Yeah. Hey, yeah. Congratulations. Uh, congratulations, Bo. Thank yeah. you. <laughs> Thank you. You are the dickhead. I'd like to say thanks to my sponsors, Helco. <laughs> <laughs> you gave us the uh, tackle that we needed today to make my uh, rod go in the water. So thank you very much. <laughs> All right, guys, that's a wrap. We're going to enjoy dinner. We will see you in the morning. Later. Right, oh, we're getting loaded up this morning. We are heading out trying to chase doggies. That's the uh, that's the plan. You know, with a bit of luck, we might find a couple of other things down there. Most of us are pretty new to chasing uh, doggies and uh, this style. So we got the bigger guns. Uh, we got split tips. 
running off to our float lines, flashes out. It's sort of, it's gonna be a bit new to all of us. So it's gonna be good fun today. We'll sort of just take it easy, get the team sorted, make sure everyone's safe and knows what they're doing. But um, pretty bloody excited. We got all the big float lines, the big guns are out. Let's get into it, mate. And we're back. We're back with no doggies, unfortunately. But uh, epic day in the water. It's uh, a new experience for a lot of us doing that uh, deep blue diving. So it was good fun. We did see some the second we got in, but no one was uh, ready and there was no guns in the water and they were gone before you knew it. But uh, we're gonna kick back, have a bit of lunch and uh, we'll have another go with Sarvi. Lunch time. Oh, Lunch time, Larry's. Bit of bacon and eggs on the go, Sammy. Get it going. Yes, sir. Uh, all afternoon snorkel. How is it? Beautiful. Beautiful. Couple Bloody of sharks. Great. Couple of sharks. Couple of big sharks. Some, Some GPs. Red bass. I'm Larry Leetel. We've had lunch, we've had naps, everyone's just waking up and we're jumping back in the boat. We're gonna head out for another little spearing session. Uh, this time maybe a little bit shallower and chase a few different species. So, um, see how we go.
this was the brand new Adreno Poseidon. We got absolutely mauled, uh, which you just saw. So that's the end of that one. I'm gonna have to get a new spear for that, but we did get a couple of fish today, so let's grab them out of the esky. Righto, so we got the beautiful long nose. Oh, the only two lads to get some dinner fish. So that was what I tried to shoot, and we got done, but Critter got the job done. So we're uh, we're gonna cook these up, and uh, we're gonna get stuck into a couple of lorries. Cheers! <laughs> Magic. Ooh. So a bit of a muck around this morning, the uh, pull toys are getting blown up and the lads are getting creative. What's going on, Jagger? Well, the plan is we've uh, taken the sail off. We're going to put the ski rope up. We're going to hoist her up the main halyard. Then we can sort of stand on the back of the solar panels there. We're going to get a bit of a run up, swing out. And send see it. See how far we get on the send. Hopefully we let go at the end. <laughs> so that's the plan. Swing off the back of the boat. Hopefully do a nice big circle around and let go before you run into the boat. What Simple. could go wrong? That Simple. Would be okay. What could go wrong? <laughs> Trick is, don't let Bo go. We'll be right. No, Bo, no. <laughs> Bo, Bo is a no no. <laughs> We're going to grab the tender, all the gear, all the floaty toys, a couple of scurf boards, head over to the back of the island and have a bit of a carry on. Let's through on uh, real teaser this thing is absolutely insane uh, we're pretty lucky I don't know tomorrow or the next day we're actually gonna get to head out on real teaser for a full day uh, chasing Marlin so you're the man what's what's the go with real teaser oh mate, we're just a uh, liverboard uh, like to say luxury charter boat out of Broome uh, we do yeah, liverboard charters to the Kimberley uh, Rolly Shoals and Scott Reef chasing all types of sport fishing are we going tomorrow what are we chasing uh, weather permitting, mate, we'll be getting out wider rolly shoals and hopefully chasing blue marlin. Lucky we might get a stripe here and a black, but uh, yeah, 
throw some big lures around and try to get some big girls. Unreal. So uh, we're going to mix it up big time if we can get out, weather permitting. But um, if you ever want to get out and chase the big fish, we'll put the link in the description. Check it out. Hello, boys versus girls fishing comp this afternoon. Let's see who can bag the biggest fish. Yeah, the boys. <laughs> Get your own spot, you dog! Yeah, <laughs> He's yeah. gonna fish like this the whole time. <laughs> I didn't know. I didn't know you got them that small out here. Nah, it's a big bluefin, eh? It's a bluefin. It's a bluefin. Drop him! I drop him! I drop him! Oh. All right, all right, ready? It's bigger. Two to G. Two to G. Hey, there, keep it. Get it, Maddie! Get it! Oh, yeah, boy. Oh, don't, don't put too much tension on him. Let him run a bit. Alright. Yeah, the boys! Come on. Just keep it high. Yeah, you're actually winning. Alright, yeah. Towel on the tail, boys. And uh, and then lift him in by the tail. Got a real light on the leader. Oh, Here he oh he's a good oh, fish. A Holy oh, snapping oh, turtles. He is a good oh, fish. Shit. Oh no. Oh my god. <laughs> Tail. Yeah! Get in, get in, get in, get in, get in! Get in, get in! Get in, get in. Get in. Get in. this episode guys tune in next week because there's plenty more coming The biggest G on the Halco slide dog. This little thing is badass. On your money! Yeah. 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 Ready? No submission. No. <laughs> yeah. 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 We've got a uh, stunt coordinator here. We do have an engineer as well. Uh, you're on film being stunt coordinator. If anything goes wrong, we're putting all liability back onto Bobo. <laughs> Gotta love it. <laughs> That's not what we wanted. Where's 
This is a free shot. Oh, come in. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, not again. <laughs> <laughs> Where are you? It's not even hey. it's you, it hasn't been no, used yet. Right, yeah, but whose lures are they? These guys. These guys. <laughs> They're not yours. Where's your rod? They're Jade's. Yeah, They're yeah, yeah, yeah. You didn't bring a rod either. What do you mean? That's not yours. Stop filming this. <laughs> <laughs> Just reeling a little bit harder from there, mate. Yeah, perfect. <laughs> 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 